here at McLean High School. About 200 students are we next? Briefly walked out at about one this afternoon. How many more? We will have our voices be heard and not let politicians get away with any more thought and prayers without action. We will not continue to stay silent about the new normalcy of the loss of life that is this country has pushed onto us. Stay strong against gun violence. 16-year-old Bennett Bruner was among the organizers. Every time I see those headlines, it's just like, it's just crazy to think that that could happen at any school. Um, and definitely all the students here felt that, and that's why we see such a big crowd today, because it's not some fantasy issue. It's not just politics. It's affecting our daily lives and our security. In D.C., younger kids staged a walkout at Janney Elementary. Some kids the same age as the victims of the Texas tragedy. Other walkouts happened at Meridian High School in Falls Church and at Loudoun Valley High School in Purcellville. A national group, Students Demand Action, called for walkouts today, and organizers of March for Our Lives, the group that turned out hundreds of thousands to the National Mall in 2018, is now calling for nationwide marches on June 11th. How many more? To advocate for policies including universal background checks and ammunition capacity restrictions. Young voter turnout in 2020, the last election, was at or near record levels, according to a Tufts University study. The students I talked to today said they expect that trend to continue. In McLean, Scott Broom, WUSA 9.